What's up, guys? My name is Mad Squash 924 Welcome back to Get Even. On the last episode, we have found out... I don't know. We found out that, uh... Red is actually Ramsey, and Ramsey's daughter, Grace, was the person who was actually well, in the prologue oh, yes. of the game, Homewood who Cemetery. blew up. I'm afraid I do. And if the Pandora has brought you here, then you do too. And how do you know this place? It's next to the company building. It allowed Rose and I to have a certain privacy. Looks like we met here too. So where is she? Black, if you want to talk, meet me at the Homewood Cemetery just outside of town, Rose. You getting wrong? Are we going to this thing? What we got here? DNA and fingerprints confirmed. Rose Atkins. Rose? Black, listen. Of course. I know you're angry, but the wheels are in motion, and there's nothing either of us can do to stop them. I can't have anyone standing in my way, especially not you. I'm starting to remember. I was looking for Grace. I think Rose had her. I was trying to stop her. I didn't want it to be this way. But you're now a liability. Security! Make it painless. Goodbye, Black. I'm sorry. What? It made it sound like we knew her. Previously, she turned. We got a new text. I'm trying to... You won't push me around no more. This is the end of the road. I'm trying to put these pieces together. I kind of have a sneaky suspicion. And hear me out. This is just a theory. Did we, in fact, capture Grace? And being hired from Rose? It's possible. Switch that up. I want to make sure this is silenced. There we go. No connection, please retry. No reception, no required signal bars and single bars. Such a snap for a smile while away the hours. My routine is not a screen. I'm just living as a me. Trying to rake in all that green while I'm. This is weird and feels oddly not appropriate. You're supposed to explore your memory, not create a new. Don't care. Hard to see. I'm gonna find you, mate. Please don't. Oi, boys, he's over here. Chase. This way, I think. Not gonna lie, it's kind of hard to hear and listen for it with this, uh, all the music going off. Yeah, it phones this way. Okay, so it looks like we gotta go around. It's strangely really upbeat, and I don't know why. Can I just say right away, the music just feels so out of place for this game. I don't know why it's there.
Is that everybody? I think so. Let's go this way, though, right? Push up guns. Okay, let's just explore for a bit and see what we can find. Hopefully what we need to. Hmm. Where is this bag at? I hope you don't. You're gonna die, buddy. Sorry. Okay. I would say that was all of them, but it clearly isn't. to deal with these people. I'm not hiding, you're running away. You're literally running. What an irritant. Here's the phone. Why? We have to heal up. I hate that I gotta kill all these people, but like, what am I supposed to do? Okay, now that's done and over with, let's uh, go unimpeded. This doesn't make any sense. Rose wouldn't have access to this many men. An anxious mind is likely to produce more troubled environments inside the Pandora. You're not worried about anything, are you, Black? Yeah. I'm worried about getting shot. It's not real, Mr. Black. Just perceived threat that your mind is heightening inside the Pandora. It still fucking hurts. I agree. I'm sure it does hurt. Some more people on this side somewhere? Probably. Alright, so where are we exactly? What the hell? Why can't I exp examine that? So we're here. It's a map sign. The church is that that is right there. So I guess we're going that way. We're in the park area. And there's two more people. Shit. Three at least. Damn it. This is bad. Hate to pull out this gun, but uh, it seems we can't have no choice, doesn't it? I am trying to be quiet about it, though. For sure. One over here. Nope. I'm a little worried because we're in the light. Hey, if I need a cheeky cigarette, would you cover for me, yeah? You can have a cigarette on oh, your shit. designated break. You're breaking up. Fuck, I Repeat. swear something's Message moving back clear. There. Nope, you didn't see nothing. No. 
fuck me, he's up. You know, when I go to kill people, I also play me the music of the the great cheeriness. You know, if, I don't know, if the gameplay of the actual guns felt a little bit better, I wouldn't mind. The fact that it feels kind of difficult to take care of problems like this makes it a little bit uh, problematic. What's he doing? Either we're gonna have to find some ammo pretty soon, or we're just gonna have to move on. I guess we'll move on. I don't know the code. What's calling us? Weird. Could be fingerprints. Oh. Thank you for trying to help me out, Black. Alright. What are we uh, scanning for? Don't see anything. Unless we gotta scan this. I got nothing. Yeah, I have no idea. Yeah, I don't think there'd be evidence. So, uh, that phone's not applicable either. Are we stuck in here? Apparently. I know he's saying black. But it's saying it so much, it sounds like Jack now. What am I scanning for? I thought it'd be fingerprints on the panel, but, uh... I got nothing. Like, legitimately got nothing. What are we missing? It's a three-digit code. Fire tracks. Hmm. Why am I confused? Is there any clues in here that would alert to a code? No. Ah.
What about this? Oh. Hmm. I'm a bitch. I got nothing. I would think it'd be her phone too, but uh apparently not. Is there something above me? Well, all right. I know how we're going to figure out this problem together. I clearly am too stupid to figure it out or, or what. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to look it up. I know. Spoilery, I get it. But when you can't actually figure out the stupid code, because for some reason or another, it is alluded to me, then I don't know. Or code getting even. Get even. Get even. I just don't know what the stupid code is. And there's nothing to scan that I see. I've literally looked everywhere. Unless I looked in the one place that I was supposed to look. Unless I was supposed to open this. Or the back of the store. Which, nope. What's this place, a hospital? Uh, yep, it's a hospital. So what is it? I guess. The ADS... The ADS building? ADC building? Is that what this place is? ADC. Don't know. Excuse me, hold on. Do, 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 do. Still looking it up. Um, garage door, I think. Well, I literally can't even find the stupid code online. That's odd. What if I just follow the noise? Probably doesn't help, does it? this building exactly where are we again the cemetery we are at the cemetery even cemetery door code Getting the door code, do do do. Still looking at the code, do do do. Cemetery and secret meeting. I know, just give me a second.
Oh my goodness. I am the biggest dummy. It was this. So 380. I guess. Eight. This. This. I'm so sorry, everybody. I'm so stupid sometimes. Could be the fingerprints. Where I not think of? You know, the literal light. I don't know why. I always forget about the stupid light. Because I don't use it that often. And that's partially my fault. I would try to talk to you out of this, but you are not wise enough to listen. Clearly not. It was obviously apparent after what everybody else just witnessed. And that is unfortunate, indeed. Alright, so what's down here? Are we in a sewer system? What the hell is this? I need to pull out my light. I don't know what it is, though. I always forget about that particular light. Just the flashlight. I always forget it's like a UV light. So, I don't know. I don't know why I always forget about it and not even try using it. Not this time, though. Look at that. Okay. The Mad Hatter? Okay, so we, can we get any information through this thing now? And if not... Uh... I appreciate your curiosity, Mr. Or Black. Code. I'm afraid you'll have to let this go for now. That's fine. I'm just trying to explore, figure some things out, you know? But sometimes you gotta do that. I feel like it's in this room, though. I could be wrong, of course. What's our map light? This just leads back to where we were. What on earth? Oh, no doubt. This place again. Oh, shit. Hate that. From Rose to Clara Bombara. What's up? Is this still your email address? I tried calling the other day, but there was no answer. I don't know if maybe you've changed your number. Anyway, I'm sick of working my arse off for a man who just keeps going home to his family. He keeps saying that things aren't right between them and that eventually he'll leave them and be with me. But he's been saying that for years now. Sometimes I wonder if he's just using me. One would wonder. <laughs> Red. This is good. This is your mind connecting the dots. These That's are not fragments, good. but memories nonetheless. Do proceed. Hey, so uh, I arrived in Birmingham yesterday, and I've been, I've been for the interview. I just staying in a shitty little B and B for now. But if I get the job, which I won't, then I'll need to find a place to stay. So uh, you can come visit. The West Midlands are lovely this time of year. I don't know, but why I feel so nervous about the whole thing, I don't... I know you tell me that they'll be stupid not to take me, and if they don't, it's their loss. I don't know, Clara. I think it would be my loss. Anyway, just gotta go in there and be the best version of myself I can be. Wish me luck. Sketchy. Just writing to let you know that I got the job, and I am now officially a lab... Assistant at FDG, Robert Ramsey's lab assistant to be exact. That name probably means nothing to you, but he's a pretty big deal in the tech world. He's working on a headset that he thinks will be capable of accessing memories. Pretty crazy shit. Hey, maybe you'll even see me on a magazine cover like we used to joke about. I'll head back to London soon for the next weekend. 
and uh, we can have a drink. I see you. Sorry, it's been a while since I got last wrote. Things are going okay up here. I got a guy fired the other day. His name was Greg, and he totally deserved it. Tell me a stupid bitch when I refuse to believe his little story about a death in the family. As an excuse for his poor quality of work, nobody else could see him for who he really was, but I could. I had to download some dodgy porn to his work computer to get him in the sack. So he's gone now. Bye, Greg. Never got someone fired before, but this is the first for everything, huh? How are things with you? That's sketchy. Has it really been nearly a year since I last wrote? Goodness, I'm so sorry, Clara. We must be... We must meet up rather than just email each other. Let me know when you're free and, and you can come and stay. Now's not a good time because everything is busy with work, but soon. Jobs group doing great. You know that thing we used to joke about? That the best way of getting ahead is probably just sleeping with your boss? Well, I decided... You're right. I know it's not easy, so you mustn't tell anyone, but... I finally managed to seduce my boss, Robert. He's married, and he's got a kid, so I don't want to get in the way of that, but I'm being treated a lot better at work. I reckon I might even get a pay rise soon. Tell me some time, and I'll tell you about it. That's kind of fucked up. That's fucked up. Okay. I know it's been a while, and you've probably forgotten all about me, but I'm thinking I might head home to London sometime soon. I'm still caught up in this affair and feel so underappreciated at work that it's not even funny. I've been working harder than anyone else in this department, even my boss, and nobody wants to acknowledge it. I really think I need to do something to make everyone sit up and take notice, you know? I was talking to this guy, Black, who's head of security here, and he's had enough too. He feels like everyone is on the verge of breaking point. Oh, so we were security at Ramsey's place. I do all the work, and he gets all the credit. I think it's time to end this. I can do a better job than he can with a Pandora, and I'm sick to death of being strung along by a man who doesn't have the balls to commit to anything. Am I starting to hate that man? Look at me waffling on. I probably don't even use this address anymore. If you do get this, call me. Ah. So, Black was a security man. What, what the, the hell? Fuck? I didn't say that. I said, what the hell, Black? Goodness. I didn't say that. Language. You fucking nut. Is this the hospital? How's going on? What's this? This isn't my memory. No, Mr. Black, nope. this is one of mine. You need to focus and regain control of your environment. Focus on what? I can't remember what happened. Just focus on Rose. The Pandora will do the rest. Okay. Listen, Ma. Yeah? When all this is over, why don't we do what we always said? Go away. Leave it all behind. Jesus. Rose, can you not see what's going on here? Just hold off until I've done the audit on Black. He's already been signed over to me, and... Rob, don't do the audit. I'm begging you not to do the audit. Please. For me. Why? Because I love you. There are things you shouldn't know. Things nobody should know. If you dig too deep, I'm worried. Rose. I'll be fine. We'll be fine. What's this? You're going too far, Mr. Black. Focus. This is your way out. Use it. My way out? This elevator? Oh, uh, okay. <gasps> Another one of these things. All right, puzzle time. So we... Okay. So we're trying to get the elevator running, right? That one's for that. Oh, 
Okay, so we want this open and this one turned on as well. Put this away. Is that what we want? Well, how many volts do we exactly need to get this thing running? Unless I'm supposed to have one in each. That's possible, I guess. What's down here? Let's use a flashlight. See if we can find anything out of the ordinary. Give us any clues. Oh, okay. Is there a button that we can uh, press over here somewhere? Probably. Okay, so what if we um, flip this up and flip this down? No. Well, we need power, right? Oh, that's 2,000. Oh, wait a minute. That's 5,000 volts. Five. That's 10,000. That's 2,000. 2, 10, and 5. So that should be enough for power. And then we need enough to make this running. So we need... Okay, I understand. I, okay, I get it. I get it. We should be good. Nice. That took me a second to understand that. But, you know, once we figure it out. What the hell's going on? Are we locked in a tiny room? Sketchy. And, okay, so we gotta go that way. And I think with that, we'll end today's episode here. Hope you guys all enjoyed today's episode of Get Even. If you guys did, feel free to leave a like, leave a comment. Tell me what you guys think of today's episode. If you're new to my channel, been watching me for a little while, you haven't done so as of yet, feel free to subscribe to me, MadSquash924, over on YouTube, where my channel is right there. And don't forget to ring the bell to get notified of my latest videos. In the next episode, we're exploring a hospital, I guess? Um... And the next episode may be the final, may not be. I don't know how much is left of the game, but it feels like we're actually coming very close. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.